My region is Africa. Uh, so we have, uh, I come from uh, the African Forestry and Wildlife Commission. We basically are operating within the African continent. Um, we have a membership of 49 countries within that region. Um, basically, uh, the reason why we are Forestry and Wildlife Commission is because of the importance and the cross connections between forestry and wildlife. Uh, in, in, in our continent. We have, like you know, um, in Central Africa, we have the Congo forests, very dense forests, um, running towards Central Africa. But as you move towards Eastern Africa and towards the Sahara and the Sahel, it's a completely different uh, arrangement. And therefore, you can see the diversity uh, between the member countries of my commission. And therefore, uh, some of the issues that the commission has been uh, concentrating on is apart from the uh, Cong Congo forest, you know, the tropical forests of the Congo, we have also been very concerned about uh, dry land forests in that region. Uh, because most of the member states are dealing with, with those, within those dry land uh, forests. Dry land forests that are very um, susceptible to climate change, that are very fragile ecosystems, and, and, and therefore how they are managed, the, uh, the, the, the resources within those uh, forests are critical to the livelihoods of the communities that live in those areas. Lean for levels um, are low. Um, community activities are majorly uh, a pastoralism kind of uh, way of life. And therefore, uh, those, those woodlands, other than being uh, the sources for grazing areas, both, and particularly during the dry runs, they are also the main source of wood fuel, which is the main um, energy particularly for households, uh, source in, uh, in my continent. A and so the proper management and sustainable management and particularly uh, the determination of the sustainable levels of extraction from those woodlands is extremely important. Uh, that is why as a continent we are now um, participating in issues to do with rent and rent plus basically as a way of ensuring that uh, the natural resources that we have in our continent are also contributing to the livelihoods and uh, the resilience of those uh, um, communities in, in, in the continent.